Well guys, as I expected, that was a complete waste of time. No steel watches available at Goldsmiths. And funny enough, in their wind day, they proudly presented a Daytona, a black dial Daytona, which you could look at. And I just went into the girl and I said, are you taking it? Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So I'm in Liverpool today. It's a bit cloudy. It's the 2nd of August, 2024, and I'm about to go into two main authorized dealer in the heart of Liverpool. One is called DMN or David M. Robinson, and the other is called Goldsmiths. I'm gonna ask them if they got any Rolex watches available to purchase to a walk-in, and I'm pretty sure the answer will be no. Now I'm not asking for me, I just picked up a Batgirl last week and I'm currently wearing a Yachtmaster. But I'm asking for you guys so that you don't have to waste your time. I was here about six months ago and I'm pretty sure today is an absolute waste of time. So without further ado, let's head into Liverpool and see what we can find. I'm at the Arbor Docks today, as you can see. It's all hustle and bustle here, and I'm heading into central Liverpool to see what I can express an interest in buying in a year's time for you guys. It's now that time, guys. It's time for Deal of the Week. 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 Hi, guys, and welcome back to deal of the week in this episode we're only going to cover one watch we're going to cover a rolex sub mariner reference number one two four zero six zero now this one is from the swiss link surprise surprise this watch is so fresh it's not even on the website and we've had to get james that's james's hand would you believe to model the watch so you guys could see it. And we do have a picture of the set. It's a full set and it's a March 2021 Submariner. Now, if you notice, I keep saying Submariner. I don't say Submariner, no date, because there's no such thing, guys. It drives me bananas when people say Submariner, non-date and Submariner, date. I haven't got an issue with Submariner, date. I have an issue with people calling it a Submariner non-date. The fact you call it a Submariner should imply it is a non-date. Just bugs me. That's all I want to say on the subject. Right, back to this watch. This watch is a stupendous one and done Rolex. Current MSRP is a whopping £8,050 from an authorised dealer. Now, if you don't have a buy history, you will not get this watch. If you don't have a relationship with an authorised dealer in the United Kingdom, you will not get this watch. This watch is a two, three year waitlist piece. It just is. So, why the urgency? Why get this watch out before it even hits the website? It's because of the deal, guys. This deal is too good to pass on. I'm tempted to buy this watch myself. So let's recap. It's 2021 full set Submariner. Current MSRP, £8,050. Now, if you're quick and you quote reference number 009, which you're going to have to get on the phone and get on the old email, you can have the watch for £8,750. Dead. Dead. That is £700 above MSRP. I've not seen a full set of Mariner that price anywhere else, especially a new card in warranty watch with a watch that also has a two year manufacturer warranty remaining on it and a one year's warranty from the Swiss Link. You can't do better than that, guys. Remember, it's reference number 124060, the new reference number. Thanks very much, and good luck and happy hunting on Deal of the Week. 
I hope you get in there fast enough because this watch is not going to hang around. And I'll catch you on next week's Deal of the Week. guys as I expected that was a complete waste of time no steel watches available at Goldsmiths and funny enough in their window they proudly presented a Daytona a black dial Daytona which you could look at and I just went into the girl and I said are you taking a piss and um, showing us watches we're not allowed to buy and she had the cheek to say you know some people want to try them on I'm like yeah and some people want to buy the bloody watches too so they're back to showing you watches you can't get. Now, in fairness, Goldsmiths are still taking names and they said as a walk-in they would have an Explorer 36 available to buy as a new customer. And remember, I'm asking for you, not for me, guys. Then I went to David M. Robinson and uh, they basically had nothing available, guys. Absolutely nothing. Expression of interest again, which is a total waste of time, guys. If you want a Rolex from an authorised dealer in Liverpool, you are wasting your time, guys. You really are. On a positive note, I popped in to H&T Jewelers in central Liverpool, and I spoke to the manager, Tracy, and they had some real bargains, guys. They had a Batman for 11,000 and they also had a Datejust two-tone diamond dial champagne. I think it was a 2021 for just under 10 grand. I mean, they're gorgeous watches. I, I took some video footage of them and wait to see what they've got. So to some of you want a Rolex watch pre-owned in Liverpool, go and see Tracy and the team at H&T. Don't bother going to DMN or to express an interest in a watch you're never going to get. And don't bother to go to Goldsmiths to look at a Black Dar Daytona 
food that they're never going to offer you. It's an absolute joke. Now with Goldsmiths, they allowed me to take pictures inside the store with permission of watches that they will allow you to purchase on the spot. And judging from the pictures, there's not a single one in there that I would recommend. Now, I asked her in real detail, come on, come on, what have you got? What have you got? And they just don't understand that I'm not asking for me. And all I managed to get out of her was a, a 36 millimeter Explorer steel, if you're lucky. So again, if you want to get a Rolex watch in Liverpool, from an authorised dealer, forget it guys, forget it.